I'm in Ticino, Switzerland, which is the southernmost part of Switzerland, just a couple of miles from Italy. And I'm hiking along the Chestnut Trail <laughs> 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 with goats. <laughs> one very curious one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ticino is known for its chestnut trees. They are everywhere. In fact, it used to be used as the main source of food. They were they would ground up the chestnuts and, and turn it into pastas. They would use it because it's nutrient dense, protein dense, and has a lot of fat. So every time a child was born, they would plant a chestnut tree. So this is what they look like. They're these very <laughs> there are these spiny, prickly things, and when you break it, uh, there's the, the actual nut. Let's see if I can find one. Here's one. So once it breaks, you have the actual chestnut, and then within the outer shell is the edible part. It's time intensive, but they're delicious, and the dessert's amazing. So it's something different to do when you're traveling. Instead of just sitting in a bus and looking at things, go on a, on a chestnut trail trek with goats. That's what I do when I travel.